welcome to Julia's Turkish Kitchen. Today I'll be sharing my take on a classical dish from the Creole cuisine, mushroom and red kidney bean rugai. Keto friendly, this is a healthy and satisfying main meal which you can also turn vegan by omitting the butter. Here's what you'll need to create this dish. This quantity serves approximately four people. I've added Turkish subtitles throughout for my Turkish audience's convenience and encourage you to subscribe if you haven't already done so to receive weekly recipes from my channel of more delicious recipes with a Turkish flavour and my take on a few of my favourite non-Turkish dishes like this one. Let's get started. Cut in half then slice thinly 400 grams of mushrooms. These can be any type of mushroom but button mushrooms work particularly well in this recipe. Include the stalks which you can cut separately into pieces. Once chopped, set aside. Wash and trim five spring onions before chopping them into approximately one centimeter pieces. Remove the seeds from the peppers before chopping into same size pieces. I have used one capia and one green bell pepper, but this dish is versatile and you can use whichever peppers you have handy. Finely chop six garlic cloves. Be generous with the garlic as this really adds flavor to this dish. Cut in half, then thinly slice one large white onion. Chop a generous bunch of parsley. Then finely dice two large tomatoes. You can substitute the fresh tomatoes with one tin of plum tomatoes. Once the vegetables have been prepared, we can move on to cooking them. Melt 60 grams of butter in a large frying pan with three tablespoons of olive oil. When the butter has melted, add the sliced onions. Saute on high to medium heat, stirring continuously. When the onions have softened, add the sliced mushrooms. Continue stirring on high to medium heat until the mushrooms begin to caramelize. This should take about 10 to 15 minutes, then add the chopped garlic. Mix for a few minutes to distribute the garlic, then add the chopped capia pepper. Add the chopped bell pepper and the chopped spring onions. Mix to combine all the ingredients. Reduce the heat and keep stirring for approximately 10 minutes until all the vegetables soften. Once all the vegetables have softened, add the seasoning. I've added one tablespoon of mixed herbs, one teaspoon paprika, half a teaspoon black pepper, and one teaspoon of salt. You can vary the seasoning according to your taste and make it even more spicy if you prefer. Blend in the seasoning, then add the tomatoes. This can be either fresh tomatoes or one tin of plum tomatoes. Simmer on medium to low heat, stirring continuously. Then add one tablespoon of pepper or tomato puree. Blend in, then add 260 ml of boiling water. Gently mix to evenly distribute the ingredients. Leave to simmer for about 10 minutes, then add the pre-cooked red kidney beans.
gently fold in. Add half a teaspoon of cumin, which goes very well with the red kidney beans. Give it a final mix, then allow to cook on low heat for a further 10 minutes. Then add the chopped parsley. Blend in and simmer for five more minutes before taking off the heat. Afiet Orson, enjoy. If you enjoyed this video, please like, share and subscribe for more delicious recipes from Hulia's Turkish Kitchen.